Good evening everyone. Welcome to Stock Market Analysis brought to you by Ray Financial. Today is July 4th, 2013 and I just want to quickly discuss the June 2013 performance with you all. So I had four stocks which I had lined up in order to execute the trades but it seems that two of them did not come into my buy zone and sell zone. The two of them was Reliance Industries and the second one is Grassum Industries. Well, both of them completely missed out. Grassum is still moving in a sideways pattern. I'm going to bring that stock up for you right now. So, my entry point was between 2666 and 2720, but as you can see, we are just moving in a sideways pattern and I would just not enter the stock right now and would completely cancel the trade. As for Reliance Industries, the trade went in a complete opposite direction but keep in mind I did not enter because I was looking to go short. So here we are on Reliance and if you notice as per the report I sent my entry point was supposed to be 755 triple five and we haven't yet reached there so in a way th this trade is still pending but reliance has started to move in the opposite direction and I would I would just leave it aside I would not take any trades on this one as of now the two trades that I did take was Bharti Airtel and this was this was something that really worked out my entry point was between 266 and 273 I just got at the nick of 273 uh, after I sent out this report and my target was 285 and the price went way about that it went all the way till 301 by June 19th so I exited the stock with 14 points in profit and one stock that did not go in my favor was Esbin and I was quite disappointed because I really thought that we would have made a good up move if you see from this particular point from this point I expected the stock to actually start moving up to a retracement of maybe 38 percent but it did not it um, it took the support of the 20 moving average and the stock started to move in the opposite direction so I got out with a loss of 25 points on the stock well as for the market it was pretty much what I thought um, let me just get out of this and bring up nifty for you so these were the levels that I had marked and I was very clear that if the market does break down uh, close to that moving average which I indicated which was the E89 the market is going to move in the uh, downward direction but as the same time at the same time we had um, we had clearly shown new levels where you could have entered uh, unfortunately I did not take any position in the futures nor in the options I was just concentrating on those four stocks but um, it, you know it was a great bounce from 5,562 5, levels all the way to where it is currently right now uh, just keep keep uh, tuned uh, check my next video and in that I will be discussing the July uh, analysis for the market I wouldn't be having that many stocks to discuss but uh, definitely something on the markets uh, if any questions just send me an email the details are in front of your screen and hope to see you soon again thank you